this is Luke Perry. The second biggest story in sports today is Michael Jordan's return to basketball. The first biggest story, right here at the Cow Palace, Bull Riders only. Check it out. You know, during one of our intermissions tonight, we had a chance to see one of your students and a, and a television star. How about uh, Luke Perry's ride? He looked pretty good, you know it. Well, Luke Perry, you know, I had him, they, they called me up and said, we hear you're the world's greatest teacher. I said, I am, but I'm expensive. You know, so they said, well, we got this actor and uh, we want him to be able to ride a bull, but we can't put him on a bull because he breaks a leg, breaks an arm, breaks a neck. We're out $10 million. But once the movie's over and we got everything in the can, then we're going to put him on bulls. I said, I can do that because I teach with drills. I don't have to put him on a bull. I put him on horses. I put him on you know, drill barrels, drop barrels, all kinds of stuff. But I'll get him trained. You know? uh, I sent him to the equitation center, so he rode, he, he took beginning horseback lessons and then beginning jumping lessons. And then he bought two jumping horses and brought them down. So we practiced on jumping horses, did circle drills on them, did these drills. Every drill I did, we did for three months. Uh, actors are paid pretenders. When I, when, I, when I was role modeling George Paul, the greatest ranked bull rider I've ever seen, all I did was, I didn't visualize Gary LeFew riding, I visualized George Paul riding. And I said, that's me, I can do that, that's me. Subconscious, anything you, you put through it, it will believe. You just gotta do it repetitiously. So three months of, of programming J George Paul in my mind. The first bull I got on, I was one point off the all-time record. I went three months out getting thrown off. I went all the way to runner-up for the world's championship behind George Paul, second at the NFR behind him. So I blew by everybody else like this, Dan and Mill, Larry Mann, you name them, all of them. I went ahead of every one of them. Only one guy ahead of me was George Paul because he was best ever, you know. So that's what role modeling does for you. Him being an actor, he was pretending everything Everything you did, I, had, I said, just watch these 20 minutes of, of Lane riding, and every time you're doing them, pretend you're Lane Frost. That's what actors do. It's called getting into character. You feel like it, and you act like Lane Frost. He got on that first bull, he nodded his head just like, okay, man, okay, man, okay, man, that bull come out. He made a perfect ride. That bull kicked over his head and turned back right there. He rode him about six seconds, spurred him the next, you know, the next two seconds, stepped off perfect on his feet and did that. You know, blowed everybody away. You know. You bet. Luke Perry rode four bulls the last day of the movie down there on the Lane Frost story. But look at here. This bull gets him a little back. Look at this move over the top of his head. I mean, 74 points the judges marked him for the fun of it. That would have made it the second go around. That was a nice ride. Well, now we're going to go to the uh, arena.